Welcome to episode 49. Turns out I couldn't fit it all in one episode. One thing worth noting when I was trying to board this thing is that I load a few times, and that's mostly because I'm learning, I'm trying to figure this out, and I'm just having some fun and seeing what different things work and what things don't work. So a few different loads, don't worry about it, is just for this, and it's fun. Buckle your seatbelts, we're about to pirate a pirate. Hmm, you know what? I wonder if I could pirate this ship right here. In Karkachua, Raider. Yeah, this is a pirate freighter. I wonder if I could pirate it. Ooh, that might be cool. <laughs> it's just on a whim, right? Uh, the problem, of course, is that all the crew are on the walrus. I could really use that, though. I think I should get it. Yeah, why is it just kind of hanging out near my stuff? Awaiting orders. In Karkachua, Raider. That is against the law. No, it's not. I am the law in this sector. All right, he's got 119 crew. Ugh. Well, we can probably still do it. I need to get Big Chew for one ready. Well, technically, I could have the Walrus do it, right? Walrus has already got. You know, I, I, if I turn these guys into Marines, I like how you can just say, "Well, not the able ones," because they're trained for that. So take everyone who's apprentice and make them Marines. And I've got 122 now, which is like pretty cool. And I can get rid of this order and just tell it to board, right? I think that'll work. 122. Just go with very strong again so that they get in there. I might lose a few, but that's okay. I want that ship. <laughs> and I don't know. I don't, I mean, it might fire back. It might. But the walrus should have pretty good shields to, to withstand that. I guess we'll find out. I got a save ready in case it doesn't work. Boarding teams preparing for launch. The irony, of course, is it's scale plate, <laughs> which makes me very happy because I hate scale plate. <laughs> and um, you know what? I think I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take its engines out. Fence drone on me. Large flak artillery.
That didn't work. <laughs> I know what I'm going to do. <laughs> yes, I have a better idea. Okay. Where was I? So you guys get to be Marines again. Confirm. And take that order away and put you on fly here. Or, yeah, around there somewhere. I'm going to take... Gosh, how do I get... How do I get my reaction force to not kill it when I get in a fight with it is the question. Because... I'm going to take one of these katanas, possibly the Mason one. Katana. And I'm going to attack that thing with this because I can take a lot more hits in the katana than I can with the rodent. And since he's not hostile to start with, it gives me a little bit of time to analyze the situation. Ooh, this thing is sluggish. So, let's see what we get. Incarcatua, Raider. Large flak artillery in the front. Travel engine in the back. Shield generators in the back. Another large travel engine. Medium. Not going to worry too much about the medium turrets. Probably. The large shield generator is on the back and the rear. Large fusion burst turret. That needs to get taken out. Two of them. And a large flak artillery in the front. See was Looks like on the side. All right. So the main threats would appear to be the... The two large turrets on the back and the one large turret in the front as the primary threat and the two engines to get it to stop because he's going to try and bolt as soon as I start firing. Now, I do have the graviton. No, 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 I'm not in the graviton. I have the, um, the mason, don't I? I have the mason lance, which should really, really go a long ways to making this quicker. All right, so yeah, I ha he was going in travel mode, so I had to quick stop him. Um, the travel engines. Well, there's, there's one engine down. I keep hitting the wrong button. I meant to do that. Travel engine. Here we go. <laughs> Shit. You know, maybe I didn't need to... These things are powerful. Holy shit. Um, I'm going to have to poke it with the lance just to get him out to, to not be in travel mode. Stop your attack immediately. Sorry, I didn't mean it. <laughs> I'm going to, yeah, this is, this is, I'm going to try to hit this engine here. Raider. Okay, yep. Oh shit! <laughs> they go so fast! Holy cow! Alright, well he's not going anywhere. Let's see if I can find that uh, fusion. I'm not sure what he's hitting me with, but it's hitting me hard. Uh, 
Now, I have to make sure that the reaction force doesn't help me, because that would be bad. You can stay here. Let's just see something here, because it was hitting me with whatever this is. I think that's the fusion. I think, I think, oh, yeah, I was thinking that this was, the, <laughs> it's the shields. Whoopsie. That's why it hurts so bad, because the large fusion turret is beating the snot out of my katana. Weirdly enough, this is a rather well-armed raider? <laughs> really? Try this one more time. I got it. Now that I know what that is. All right. My priority is going to be taking these two fusion turrets out on the top. For some reason, I can't target this one. I'm going to have to poke him first just to get his travel mode to, to stop working, but then I'm going to have to take his engines out, but hopefully not destroy them. And then after that, I'm going to take out those two turrets on the top of the uh, ship because they hit really, really hard. I can hardly believe that this ship has three, three large turrets for a freighter. That's not bad. I'm going to have some, some fun exploring this thing. So let's go. Raider. You cannot tolerate your actions. So there we go. Now. One engine out. There's two engines out. No, I just gotta get the fusion burst. And the other fusion burst. Okay, okay. Got some sewers in the bottom here. I don't want my turrets doing more than... I mean, this is a precision strike, right? So... Yeah, those engines will be out of commission for a while. Take that sea is out. <laughs> this, I love this weapon. It's so fun. <laughs> okay. Well, that's in the front. Hunter tree. It's a mile away. It's a mile away. And I just wiped it out. <laughs> yep, 
Yep, I think that's all the weapons except the flak in the front, the large flak. So I'm just going to kind of casually fly over there and, uh, and deal with that. Man, this thing is huge. This ship is so big. Alright, so as soon as I get a beat on this thing, without... It should be right about... <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Now, now, <laughs> okay, the walrus, <laughs> which is my, <laughs> which is my pirated prawn builder. <laughs> I need to make sure, okay, it's got 122 marines, so we're going to send those here, and we're going to put all of them. How come I can't? Oh, yeah, that's I keep forgetting how this works. All 122 recruits and okay, destroy turrets to improve chances of boarding pods arriving safely. Yeah, I'll just put medium because I already took in out all the turrets. Damage hull to reduce the time needed to breach the target. Uh huh. Well, I think I've done that. Medium, yeah, medium. Okay, start operation. Now, I have to damage the hull, which should be hard. Take orders. Thing is, this, the Mason Lance is really fun and really cool, but it heats up so fast. Oh my gosh. Watch my temperatures of my, my guns here on the right. <laughs> it just, it, it, it does, it just melts his, it's the target, it just melts it, but it also melts my own ship because it's like, ooh, it gets hot fast. All right, I'm gonna make sure these engines don't actually get repaired. Uh, looks like looks like they'll be out for a while. Eighteen percent, ten percent. Yeah, they're fine. Oh. Yep. Oh, I I could so kill this ship with this weapon. Hmm. So I'm kind of wondering about my boarding pods because they're they should be coming out by now, right? Board, stage in progress, medium. I mean, I've destroyed all the turrets, so I don't know what it's waiting for. I hope I don't have to do this over again because I'm picking the wrong setting. I know we deployed a, a laser turret. Um, maybe I can find that and take it out. Where's that laser turret? Laser tower? Whatever. Yeah, it's this guy. Come on. Shit. Alright, I'll have to wait for my weapons to cool down. Oh, look at this. Now that's interesting. Even though my weapons have cooled off, they still won't fire. I think that's because I overheated them rather than letting them cool on their own. I'm not sure if that's how it works, but it's, it seems like it might be likely. Because they're still red and they won't fire. Another blue, okay. <laughs> I just love this gun. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You can't do that. <laughs> Raider. Okay, okay. 
So basically, I just... Oh, wait. Are we boarding pods? I think... Maybe? No. No, that's our... It's just a walrus's repair drone. Something's firing. Yeah, he keeps repairing, is the problem. Alright, everything should be in working order now, in terms of the boarding operation. Maybe it's the walrus getting into position. Maybe that's what's taking so long. Because, you know, it's a slow ship, right? It's big. Look at the size of that thing. That's the walrus. I mean, this, this ship here is enormous. I didn't realize that the Carcachua was so big. I hope those boarding pods come out, though, because I've got everything ready. Everything should be per perfectly prepared for this thing. He's not going into travel mode, is he? I heard a travel engine spin, spin up. what I'm going to do. Yeah, I didn't I didn't mean to take that engine out. I am going to make another I'm just going to make another fire group here with only one. That'll cut my damage down a lot. There we go. <laughs> that gives me a bit more precision. But he shouldn't be going anywhere, man. Yeah, he's... Ooh, 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 the pods are launched. The pods are launched. This is so exciting. Look, look, look. Acknowledged. Now, did they go inside? I thought they would go to the hall and just stick to the hall or something. Well, this one did. An idea. I need an update. It's going to blow. What do you mean it's going to blow? Okay, does that does that term does that does that piece of dialogue not mean the ship is going to blow up? Or does it mean something to go inside the ship is blowing? Like progress in the in the breaching. Sit rep. We're pushing through. Lots of resistance. Lots of resistance? Why is there lots of resistance? Here. I want to see the progress. All right. We, we still don't have... You know, I scanned it, right? Didn't I scan it? I thought I scanned it. Sit rep. Continuing combat. No, 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 no. Repair no. drone. In I need an update. Continuing combat. All right, he's got a hundred crew. Ooh, that's not good. Ninety-three now. I need an update. Continuing combat. Oh no. Oh no 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 no! I don't have enough. Sit rep. I don't have we are enough. Pushing Lots of resistance. Mm. All right, this isn't going to work. I, I'm going to need a lot more people. Heavy losses. Yep. Sorry, sir. This isn't looking good. All right. <laughs> 
I will try again because I am determined to have this ship. <laughs> so as you can see, things didn't exactly go as planned. Anyways, we'll keep trying. Thanks for watching. Catch you next time.